It's time it's about me, I'ma take a little break, I'ma let my mouth free I've been fighting like I'm my lead, put the team on my back, all my niggas gon' eat I ain't talking about no damn crumbs, I'ma show you how it's done, all my niggas gon' feast Cups in the air, cause we almost there, one foot in the door, one foot in the streets so we Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls across the world we're back. Blunt Exchange, episode nine. <laughs> what voice is that? I don't know. I really <laughs> feeling know. different? I think so. It's just something like this. Like you're feeling more official. Time. Like you're sounding more official. Like I different. Like, like something this. changed. Anything happened? Like yo, yo, yo. What's back? Oh, man. But I kind of like <laughs> it. Fucked it up again. You fucked it up again, <laughs> man. No. No, but I'm saying like, I, up, I'm not going to lie to you, Crump. You sound okay. more official. Like, oh, it's like something changed up. Oh, like something, Anything happened? I don't know. Are you more official than you were before? The day before? Nah. No, nothing's changed. Uh, maybe I'm feeling. A, I was I was good for a couple of day weeks, and then I feel I felt a little under the weather the past three days. I don't I don't know what else. What about you, Blake? You feel different? Feel good? Is it is it because of the new year? I don't I don't know. New year, new me. That, feeling good, Blake? That, Anything that different? You feel different? I feel different. I for one. I feel a little different. So how you feel different? Talk I feel like there's a there's some air, there's something in the air. Something in the air, right? Something a little different this year. 2020s feel a little 2020 different. 2020 started. But I feel a little different, Blunt Exchange. Oh, talk to oh, us. Tell them why you oh. why you different. I feel like I feel like we're a little bit more official than we were the day before. Okay. Because not only can you see Blunt Exchange on YouTube now. Oh, I forgot. Oh, I forgot. Oh, I'm stupid. Not only can you watch <laughs> Blunt Exchange on YouTube, we are officially available. Uh, on Spotify. Woo! Bing! On Spotify, baby. Go to catch Spotify. Catch up on all the episodes. Catch up on all the episodes. Give us love. I mean, you can listen to all eight episodes so far. They're all there. All and uh, Apple. Nine on this one. What's going on, Apple? Apple we, we they, said soon, they said soon. They said soon. They said soon. But what's going on, I Apple? I don't know. Tim Cook uh, still might be mad at that joke. <laughs> that Ricky Jarvis Yo, joke. That Ricky Gervais joke was mad. Gervais funny. is a Gervais. No, he killed that Gervais? intro. But... It's episode nine. Episode Take nine. It over, episode G. nine. Welcome back to the Blunt Exchange. I'm here with some of my best friends, some of my guys, my homies. They get it in. <laughs> to the left, I got Yo, it's Crump, it's Pablo. And to the right, I got Pablo, K.A. Bleak. And I'm Aim Gunner. When we combine, we form the Blunt, Blunt, Blunt Exchange. Exchange. Throw the X's up for Blunt Exchange. Now, guys, yes. we stepped it up another level. I think so. Meditating like a Buddhist. Okay. We're meditating okay. Now, now you like Hove. I like that. Okay. Hove quotes. That's good. Yeah. But we stepped up another level, guys. Yeah, we officially cool. on Spotify. Apple's on deck. Google Play's on deck. Let's get straight into it, though. Butt of the day. Butt, butt of, of the, the day. day. Butt of the day. What's butt of the day, G? Uh, today, the butt of the day is Black Mamba OG, uh-huh. which is affectionately uh, called sometimes Kobe. Ooh. Oh, El Kobe. What, number A or number 24? Um... I mean, I guess both numbers work. But uh, I guess number 24 because it's yeah, a relatively that. new strength. Yeah, because the number eight, you know, Shaq has a lot to do with that. So oh. it should have Because <laughs> then that would be mostly Shaq OG. Yeah, it would have Just a little bit of Kobe OG. Okay. But mostly Shaq. Shaq would carry most of it. Yes. Yeah, I agree with that. But uh, it's Black Mamba OG. It's an indica. It's supposed to make you feel really good. And I'm going to light that shit up. You know what it tastes Please like? Please do. I don't know what it tastes like yet because I have yet to light it. Yes. Um, But, we, we, but while I light this... Mm-hmm. How was your weekend, Crump? Uh, my weekend was pretty trash. I've been sick. Oh. So, you know, I was fighting sickness out right now, yeah. and runny noses and, you know, Rudolph the Reindeer, Rudolph the Red Nose Reindeer Nose. Mm. So, okay. um, you know, I guess my weekend was pretty trash. That sounds like light skin problems. Oh. Nah, I'm just saying, you know, when you wipe your nose and it gets really sensitive. Yeah, and mine doesn't turn red. Yeah. It turns purple then. That was racist. How's it racist? You're a little darker. Red? My nose never turns purple. It... I think I'm going to go with red. Too. Melanin. Damn. But anyway, uh, Bleak, how was your weekend? Um, Haters going to hate. I will say that. My first weekend. Um, Facts can't be hate. Remember, remember Crump? Facts can't be Bleak hate. Let talk. <laughs> Bleak, don't, don't, don't cut on don't run, joke. Don't run away from me. Don't run away. First weekend that doesn't consist of drinking. <gasps> hey, that's it's it. Over. It's over. It's over. You didn't drink this weekend? Not that much. Not, yo, to, yo, not yo, enough yo. to, one to say. Clean. Yo, one weekend clean. Not just, not were, you, were you arrested? I wasn't arrested. Okay. I was doing home improvements. Start the new, tw- you know, 2020. Got to clean everything up. Got okay. Got to fix shit, you know? Like a little, uh, like a reset. Like a reset. Hit the reset you button. The, you you, you uh, lit the sage and, and yeah, went through the house? Yeah, lit the sage, you know, lit the sage, painted, cleaned, threw stuff out, brand new stuff in. 
Sounds good. Last time I lit the sage, I passed out. I, I, maybe that, I was the negative energy. Maybe that wasn't sage. Maybe I was the negative energy. Maybe it was a platinum regular. Maybe it was a <laughs> platinum regular. Because the sage is supposed to the sage is supposed to take the negative energy out the building. Yeah, it was you. I lit that shit. I passed the fuck out. And you, you, woke, up you, up? Were you, you woke up outside. You woke up outside. I woke up out in the hallway. <laughs> Maybe With your I was packed. <laughs> Where's my shit? Why is my that towel? That, in the that was that Sage OG. Oh. Yeah. Why is my towel outside? Y'all gonna ask me about my weekend, or should we just move on? No, how I was mean, your weekend? No, Yo, they don't right? show me no love, man. Like they don't Yo, show gee. me no love half the time. They don't want to ask me nothing, man. I don't know what Go it ahead, is. Man. You, 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 I'm so used to you not necessarily answering shit. I just didn't know if I wanted to ask you. He didn't so my bad. Ass gonna get it today. My bad. So how was your weekend, bro? My weekend was phenomenal. Yeah, so bleak. Um, oh. yeah. <laughs> Yo. All right, so. No, no, no. We got Gary. Please breathe, G. So, all right. I'm trying. Right. That, that black mamba. That mamba. Them sneak. Uh, hey, listen, man. I don't even like Kobe's like that. Those mamba sneakers ain't it. We can get into it, but what were you saying, uh, Crump? <coughs> About, um... Oh, no, I was asking you how your weekend was. I said my weekend was phenomenal. Oh, okay, what what was phenomenal about it? Uh, I took some, um, some time to reflect on the year past. I, uh, I met up with some friends, had a great New Year's uh, celebration. Facts. I saw you there, I saw you there. Yes. You guys were both yes. hammered. Yes, yes. Yep. Um, there's some footage too of that. This, all, um, this, all the world. There's footages. There's some footage. As uh, Cardi B would say, there's footages. Mm -hmm. um, but uh, <laughs> shout out to the people who who are uh, being the pictures who be so zooted and so gone. They don't even look at the camera. They don't look at the. They camera. just be like, "Yo, cameraman, trees." And it's crazy because the, the the dude photobombing our pictures, doing crazy shit, is yeah. a cameraman. So yeah. you think he would know better? He would know that. You think he would know better? You it's almost like he, he did know. it on purpose. But no. no. <laughs> Yeah, man. Uh, you know, put a picture up. Well, he yeah. wasn't even looking at another camera. You know how people look at multiple cameras? Because, you know, multiple people take pictures. But he was looking at the... He wasn't even looking at a camera. He was just, what is he even looking at? Do you, do you guys photobomb pictures? This is unfair. Is that something you do? No, nah, I, actually, I actually never... I never just volunteer myself in pictures unless people be like, yo, man, yo, crump, yo, jump in this picture. I'd be like, all right. So if you're in the background of a picture, you see your friend taking a picture in front, you don't try to do like a funny yeah, I'm stage in there. I'm or something crazy in. in the background so nope, when they I'm look back in. at the picture, like, oh, man, the nah. fuck? Because I'd be tight when people do that to me. Okay. Nah, so. I'm jumping in. Yeah, right? I'm a photo bomb. Yeah. Yeah. my mans, I'll jump in. Yeah, I'm going to make a little face I'm gonna, in the back I'm going to say, I'll make the face and they'll be like, yo, I made a face. Do Take that picture again. I won't even tell them shit. I want them to look through it like, fuck. Yeah. Well, at least they have that as well as a good picture for them. Yes, yeah. those yeah. are there are times for that. I'm not concerned about that good picture. I'm just trying to leave the memory. <coughs> what a friend of me fucking what a, what a friend. Yeah, I'm just trying to get those are the best pictures though. When you look back on them, are they? Aren't they? Are they? Aren't they? <laughs> are they? <laughs> All right. So word of the day. Word of the day. Uh, the word of the day today, guys, is magnanimous. Magnanimous. What? Magnanimous. Magnanimous. Does anyone know what guess, that means? I'm gonna take a while and guess in the dark and say something to do with like magnitude and big something. Like something, something big, really, like really magnum, big. like okay. magnum condoms. You know, you gotta have that. Magnum. Magnanimous. Mag Magnanimous. Magnum condoms aren't big enough. <laughs> Woo! Oh, oh, context, context clue, context clue. <laughs> I gotta now. I gotta get. I gotta get mine custom made. Yeah. Ooh. I cop from the emperor's new condoms. Got it. It's like there's nothing on. Straight from China. People still work on them in 2020? <laughs> no, nah, like if there was a reference. No, no, no. You didn't really have anything on. Right. They'll get that. The people will get that. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, magnanimous. Eddie, you said something big. What did you yeah, say? Yeah, something, something big regarding like yeah. magnitude. What about you? I guess so. I'm going to play it safe this it time. Is? On this episode, I, I will play it safe. Is. Sure. For a fact, I knew what it meant before I picked it, and I know oh, what it is now. Oh, smarty pants! He missed to read a book over here. I guess let's, let's make fun of him for reading a book. Huh? Story of my life. <laughs> I ain't read it. <laughs> Go ahead. What do you mean, so, Mike? So, Bleak, you did give an official answer. No, I said uh, you're gonna go with Will. Yeah, I'm going with Will on this one. I don't like that. <laughs> you don't like that? Just say it again. Oh then. no, let him do his thing. What? You don't like the way he's going about the show? Let him do his thing. I didn't say anything about him going about the I show. Mean, I'm saying he usually gives an answer. I, it'd I'm, be awesome oh. to not say the same answer as you. 
At least just say it himself. Well, I kind of did say it. I said Magnum Comics. Yeah. Okay, Magnum Comics. <laughs> All right, so magnanimous. It's an adjective. <laughs> and it means generous Gener- <laughs> or forgiving, <laughs> especially toward a rival or a less powerful person. Yo, we could have oh. not been so... Like, 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 like loving your enemies. Kind my of, God. Like, kindness kind of, like, almost... She should... Here's a my sentence. Mama she should be, she should be magnanimous in victory. Yeah. So it's like generous or yeah, charitable yeah. or something. Humble. Like that. Humble. Humble. But no, no, but it has to do with giving. Oh my God. What? Like, what was the sentence? Uh, she should be magnanimous in victory. So it's like she generous, get, like oh, gracious, oh. like charitable. Oh, yeah, like, yeah, like, yeah. Like, yeah, you killed it too. I know I won, yeah. but still you also yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Sport, that. sport, sport like or whatever. Yeah, like. charitable. Yeah, sportmanship. Good, yeah, that could be a form of magnanimous. What? Uh, mm-hmm. Or being magnanimous. Magnanimous. <laughs> There's a word. There's another word. All right, so uh, magnanimous. So try to use that, guys. You feel me? Try to be magnanimous in your everyday life as well. There you go. You know Bing. what I mean? Okay, so that's word of the day. Word of the day is magnanimous. Any topics? Anything we want to get into? I know there's a topic that we've been talking about all week, and we've been going back and forth. Okay. Um, How Luca's better at 20 than LeBron is at 20? I mean, stats, that the stats show that. No, yes. The stats show about. that, though. So. Stats do show that, for the record. Yeah. That don't necessarily so now, mean. So yeah. now the stats just, show who's better. I just wanted the stats just, show who's better now. At twenty, right? at twenty, so at second stats, season, no, second no, no, I'm, season. I'm, I'm strictly so, comparing them to their numbers. Their their points. We're only going shooting. I mean, analytics. their points, uh, points, assists, and rebounds. I was so only going by those. Three. When LeBron James was twenty years old, right? Analytics. How long has he been in the league? Two years. We're talking second year here. Both. Luca's second year. Yeah, no, I thought you second year that. You said you're saying the second year or at twenty? At twenty years old. Mm-hmm. All right. So what year was that for LeBron? I don't know. Second year. I'm man. not a LeBronologist. I don't know. He came out of high school, so he. I, I know he. I like what, that, LeBron. Uh, second year in the league. Yeah, man. We talking First second year. year. Yeah. This 18, is what we're 19, talking about. 19, 20, 20, yes. 21. Got it. Uh, who knows so what which is, one we're talking about what here? Is it? 20 turning 21? Tell me what, is it, what does it matter? What is Luca turning this year? Is I, he turning I 21? I don't, I don't know. I have no idea. What, is, what does it matter? So I, what's I really, your question? Bring it back. I don't. I forgot I didn't question. ask the question. You asked the question. I just, you just said, have, what do you want to talk about what we've been talking about for a week? For a week? And, and, I, and do, I, do, I do a joke in there. Oh, okay. Yeah, because okay. we, we haven't talked about that. I, thought I mean, you, I, I don't... Yeah. No, no, but that's what the stats do. That's say, what the yeah. There's no question. I that's just, what the stats say. I disagree yes. with that. That's it. I don't, I don't care what your opinion Second is. Second season. The, the numbers. The, the stats that's don't it. tell. The like, stats. Like your boy Jay points Z per says. game tell you who's a better player, or yeah. score who scores more points per game. I mean, who has the who has the most triple doubles this season? Here we go. Here we go. Do you know the answer to that? Yeah. What's the answer? Luca. Are you 11. sure? Yeah. Well, LeBron has eleven. No, he doesn't. He has nine or ten. He has eleven. No, he doesn't. Okay. All right. Anyway. That doesn't you want, matter. You, you, want to, you want to put another cheap beer on it? I'm not putting anything on oh, it. Oh, he's not confident. It, not confident in his convictions. No, oh. I just don't feel like this is a, even a, a topic that we should be discussing. This is mad stupid. Who this. gives a fuck about Luka Doncic? He's nice. Anyway. He's, he's leading the league. In yeah, anyway. Hold on, hold on. What do you mean? Who cares about He's, he's leading nice. the West in all-star votes right now. He, he Right now, he's poised to be the all-star game captain if it started today. Okay. so uh, That's like uh, when Yao Ming used to get like 10 billion votes. I mean, there's not 10 billion people in Slovenia or wherever he's from. But I'm just saying, like, Yao no, Ming used, to, le- Yao Ming used to lead in votes it's all the, the time. It's not the same. There's, there's billions of people in China. Yeah, but there's something that we're not we're not, we're not. Are there billions of. of people in Slovenia? How, what's is there, the, what's is the majority of people in America? They're not foreign. What are they're they? They're American white. Okay. So they're, so you, so they're white. Yeah, here we go. All right. Yeah, they, yeah. All right, so then why isn't why isn't Jok- Jokic the number one person, or Dirk Nowinski was ever the number one person, or Steve Nash the number one person, or any of these people, or any of these white people the number one person? If 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 that's what it is, because they weren't good enough to be. So Dirk wasn't good enough. Dirk, Dirk was, was great. Dirk no, was no, good no, enough. he was never good enough to lead the West in uh, All Star votes one year. He did. I think he did. No, maybe he came f- top three. I just I I don't think it's a numbers game for like I feel with. Yao Ming, it was a numbers game with China because there's billions of people in China. And with, Especially his, with how in he's Houston. balling, you really don't think it, with how he's balling, it's it's legitimized? Do you think he's the best player in the NBA? No. Okay, so then you agree with me. So moving on. I agree with you with what? That this is stupid. No, I don't agree with you. That's stupid. I think it's an argument to say it's that. It's an argument. It, if that. he's, if you're, he's you're not such the best, a Brown fan, he could be the best player in the NBA right now. LeBron. He's Why are you bringing up LeBron? Because you're clearly, you're clearly a LeBron James stand. What does this have to do with LeBron? And you're not. Wow. And you're. And what you're, does this have to do with LeBron? Because he's beating your man in All Star votes, and you're tight. Beating him in yeah, All Star votes. Yeah, he, he That's has the more competition. All-star. 
There's a there's a trophy for who wins yes. the most. Yes. Look, 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 look. Yes. There's, yes. You're, you're named the captain, so there is yes. a reason. Yeah, they started that three years ago. All right, okay. and your man was it? I mean, LeBron it, started it, that. It wasn't nothing when your when LeBron was winning it, right? I'm not saying it's an issue that that there's a captain for the All Star game. I'm just saying I don't give a fuck about this shit. It's not that big of a deal. He's the most uh, well, popular you, nigga I, according to the votes. That's what's up. Is he uh, the best player? That's not even well, Luca Johnson. Luke, are, you ask, are you asking me that? You can now? say yeah. that. You can uh, argue that. I'm just asking you. Is he the best player in the league? No. Okay, so then, yeah, we agree. Uh, yeah. It means nothing. That's could, what I'm he, saying. Could be the it best in the nothing. West right now, though. He's the best player in the I Western he Conference. Could he, no, could he, he, he could be. 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 Analytics. Analytics wise, he's one of the best. Could be. He's top five in the West. He's not. He's not top five players in the West. He's not right the now? best player in the he's Western Conference. He's top three in the oh, West. Is he not he's top, top three? Is he not top he's not the best player in the Western Conference. He's not. He's not the best player in the Western Conference. He's not top five. Uh, I mean, Bron. Huh? Yeah, I don't. I don't. There's Stats. Good you know. These, oh these man, stats. I think him. I think him. Bron. Ad. Mm-hmm. Harden. Huh? <laughs> yeah, man. I'm not, we, even, I'm not even going for Luca. I just like we mean. out of here on this Luca Doncic. Yeah, we're, we're not even gonna Luca. This dude, don't even play defense. <laughs> get him out of here. Yeah, your man doesn't. Anyway, nah, we get that Luca trash the f up out of here. Nah, he yeah. gives a damn about Luca Doncic. Yo, are you stop serious? Fuck. Yo, are you for real? Yeah, who cares about he's Luca trash? Doncic? He's, he's not trash? trash, man. He's, he's top trash? three best uh, player in the West he's right now. He's trash. He stole Rookie of the Year last year. Come on, from who? Trey Young. He's not better than Trey Young? He's way better than Trey Young. He didn't have a better rookie year than Trey Young? No, nah, he was injured like the whole half of the last half of the year. Trey Young only balled out the second half of the year. And yes. he balled he played the whole season. And Luka Doncic balled the whole season. Yes. No, he didn't. When he played, he, he balled like the whole season. The season. He didn't miss forty games. He missed a stop, lot stop of games. Stop gassing. He so how many games? games? He he obviously played enough games to qualify for rookie of the year. Yeah. Yes. And he so won it. That? So well, fall back. So fall back. Whatever. Whatever it is, he he did it. Tight? You tight? I mean, LeBron's why LeBron James won rookie of the year over Carmelo, because he's just better. Yeah, man. That was a steal, but Feel me? That was a steal. He's just better. You got it. That's what it is. That was let's a not even argue steal. those things. I mean, that's that's subjective. You're right. Let's not argue it. Steal. You're right. Yeah, LeBron James was clearly that rookie of the year that year. That's yeah, why he won. He won it. He won it. He won it. Let's get it. Yeah. Uh, so, so uh, let's talk about that question we've been talking about all week. What was the question? Did you? Okay. Have to tell, I'm gonna come up with another joke if you don't give me another. If you don't actually tell me the question, I'll throw it. It's gonna okay. be a wrap. You for forgot you. it already. Go ahead. I don't remember what it was. Okay, so you are <laughs> uh, you are dating your significant other, of course. Your signi- there you are. Yeah. You are with your significant other. Uh, you guys have been in a relationship for quite a while. Yeah. And it's very comfortable. You're doing great. Okay. Um, before, previous to this relationship, you have a best friend that is the opposite sex. So you have a female best friend. Uh-huh. Um, there is a traumatic and... Um, uh, I do remember this question. Oh, you do remember now? Yeah. There's a traumatic uh, event. event that uh very sad. Let's say let's say the death of a family member. Okay. Right? A parent. Mm-hmm. A parent. Like a parent. The death of their parent, mm-hmm. right? Okay. Their one living parent or, you know, both their parents. Whatever is like traumatic. Like it's devastating. Gotcha. Uh, they reach out to you because they're you're, you're their best friend. Mm-hmm. And they say, you guys don't live in the same state anymore. So they live at least two or three states away. Yeah. They're like, I need you to come. And stay with me and help me through this process right now. Like I need you for like three, four days. Yeah, man, pull up. Yeah, that's not a, that's not gonna happen. For my significant other, that's not happening. Why not? Because and he's and it's a guy. Yeah. So since it's your significant other, it's a dude right. that's calling her. Like right. let's say it just happened. So it's like he's calling at two o'clock in the morning. Right. Hey, your significant other. Right. Uh, I need you down here. My dad just died. You know, I'm like that's that was my last family member. You know how close you guys were as well. Right. Like I really need your support, right? And to help me guide me through this next, or or, or just no, be with I just, me. I just need some I need, to help I need, me through I this next love. situation. I need to be surrounded by some love. The, the my best friend, the person that my right. last family exactly. basically. I need, I need some consoling. I understand. Uh, so yeah. you're not okay with this? Uh, my my significant other, my girl, cannot go down there for a few days. She can go down there for the funeral. But, and, but they're best friends. Girl. Yeah, the, I mean they were best friends. They no 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 they were best friends until why are you saying that why are you saying it like once that once I came into the picture mm-hmm, mm-hmm, she mm-hmm. that is no longer her her best friend because I am now her best friend okay that's what you're saying because so, you would be her best friend since you're in a relationship right. that's the whole point of the relationship right. mm-hmm. okay um so so with that being said if I have no problem with her going down there to to get to show her love to the family and to her friend mm-hmm. but she's not going down there for days on end neither 
is she going to like drop what she, whatever she's doing that moment as soon as he calls or anything like mm-hmm, that. Mm-hmm. So um, that's that's my personal answer. You need me, okay? I mean, you need her. So how do you feel about that situation? And then I'm gonna get into I'm gonna expound a little bit more because there's some okay. stuff I still want to ask you. Okay. Um, I that whole few how many days? Three days? You said, she said yeah, three, a couple days. You said right? Yeah, yeah, three couple, days was like oh no, a couple days. She said three to four days. Three to four days. You out there? She's out there. And a all couple states away. I, I'm kind of, I'm kind of with Crump a little bit with the not going over there for that long. But there's two ways of this, right? So you said she, he, he could have been an ex. No, he's not an ex. He's not an ex. Okay, that's good because if it was an ex, there's no. They've fuck never had sex. All right. So if it's a best friend, then I put the trust on my shorty on that that she can handle that. So because she can go feelings, for three or four days. No, she can go for a day, and then I'm she sure. can just go for the funeral. Yeah, for the funeral. What if she says I want to go? For I want to go. Days. Right, so or do you feel some kind of way about that? Same question to you. Wow. I'd like to know I, what I, you, well, I, what, how you go about it. I gotta Me? put the trust. Yeah. I gotta put the trust in. My, I gotta put the. I gotta put the trust in my shorty, and I gotta. I mean, I mean, I trust. If that, that's her on, best friend, hold, hold, hold if that's her best friend, I, I'm, I'm trust, I know I trust this guy. that she's not gonna do anything. It's not about me not thinking she's gonna do, me thinking she's gonna do something. Yeah. It's not that. So what is it about then? It's Why are you so you adamant that you don't need to be there for three? Like, and she's not gonna want to. But be that's there not for, three for you. Days. But but, I, no, 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 but no, no. can you see a perspective that what you're saying right now is mad insensitive and you're being disrespectful? No, you don't know their relationship or what they have I mean, personal one on one. How are you? How can you say that there's no reason for her to be down there for three or four? Days. That's her best friend. He's in. I mean, exactly. Exactly. Just lost a parent. Yeah, the like best said, friend is not, what keeps it. They're not best friends anymore. I hear. That. So, so you're what, so what, what you're saying? So what you're saying? I'm gonna answer whatever question you ask me. Well, well so what I, you're I like saying to, is, at least uh, before you like, like, before we dive even deeper into my okay. explanation, I like to at least know like. Uh, do you want to set me up or should I just um, answer the question? Just answer it, bro. Yeah, just answer it. Um, I would like to think that if that's her best friend, I would like to think that if that is her best friend. Um. Then yeah, man, go be with your best friend. You, you know, just lost a parent or something. It's crazy. Like, I've... go support your best friend. Cause me personally, mm-hmm. and I'm not. I have no issue saying this. Like, if I'm in my emotional bag, I do need somebody with me. I mean, maybe I don't need them, but I would prefer yes. to have somebody that I, I trust, so. I that I feel so. comfortable with with me during those times. I would rather not do that alone, personally. Okay, so rather not do it alone. Can I ask your question? Yeah. Let's say you had a girl. Let's say you have um, a girl. You're in a new relationship. Let's say you're with her for a year. That's is pretty that, substantial that, amount okay, of time. All right, well, then what's whatever. All right. Well, then maybe let me take a the year. Time. I feel let like me a take lot the can time be... away. Let me take the time away. Let me take the amount of time away. You have a girl, and you go. You go through the same thing. You lose a. Uh, you God forbid, like you lose a family. You lose a parent. I lose a you lose family. a parent, yeah. and you're able me to personally. have yeah, and you're okay. able to have one person in the room with you in like the hospital room, and would you choose? Let's say. You have a female best friend, mm-hmm. and you have a girlfriend. I do have a female best friend. Uh, you do have a female best friend, and you have a girl. With, you're, only, you're only able to bring one person in there. Who are you choosing to bring in? I think, me personally, the way my life is set up, because you're asking me directly, right? Yeah. It's not like a general thing. You're asking me if, yeah. if this happened to me. Yeah, well, I would yes. want my girl with me. Uh-huh. Even if it's a, like Even a though I have more time. Let's say it's a, new, let's say it's a newer relationship. That's tricky. I feel like I would still want my girl there more because even if we don't have the time, and this is these are the times we're putting. This is the stuff so, so that and, builds and the time. So then, so these are the these are the moments so these are, that are important. Right, so these like, are the moments that we she's build. Gotta, the, yeah, the, the, so, so I want to bring her in. My friend has moments like right. So with that, if, if that's being if that being said, mm-hmm. then as soon as you get a girl, like I don't like. I don't think you're your wife and girls left and right. Like like easy like you're not just like you're not falling in love every single second. So I know that. So it takes it takes a minute for you to 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 say like, yo, that's my girl. Yeah. yeah. So with that being said, mm-hmm. then as soon as you get a girl, then your female best friend isn't your best friend anymore. That's what you're saying. Because if you if you're always gonna choose your girl to come with you into in that in that doctor's room to hear the outcome. That yes. female best friend loses that title as soon as you get a girl. I like the way you're wording that. So I'm going to push back and try to reword the question if that's okay with you. Yeah. To just lock it into no, a we're scenario. Lo- we're, we're volleying the question back and forth. Yeah, more. we're just trying to lock it in. Yeah. You know, Bleak, at any no, time, no. you let me know. If no, 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 no,
So let's just lock it in. Yeah. Now that you have a girl, mm-hmm. we're going to consider and go in with the point that your girl is now your best friend. I'll concede that to you. She's whatever. not or she Your is. girl is now your best friend. Okay. So I'll give you that because the way you're wording that, I, I would agree that your girl should be your best friend, right? Mm-hmm. Like, yeah, if it's just a girl I'm dating, then yeah, I'm not going to, I'm probably not going to call her because I'm, but, we're just dating. Yeah. Your relationship is serious enough. She's your best friend now. Right. But, however, she's never met you, your father. <coughs> your girl. <coughs> like, he's been sick the whole time that you got with this new girl. Right, and we live So the, she's never and, really had that. Like, cause we, I might, let's say we don't live in the same state or something like that. I might just or say, even if you live in the same state. When you started dating her, he's been sick this whole time. So okay. she's never really met him as himself. Okay. okay. She's just met him sick. Okay. Like, he's not responding. You know what I mean? There's no real back and forth with them. And your friend has been your friend for 15, 20 years. Is it? And, the, and you, her and your father were really close. Is my father conscious right now? He's not. He's dead. Okay. The, the, that, the fact that they haven't met doesn't really mean anything. It's, it's about me and her's current connection. But you can understand how some, some people would choose no. the best friend no. who has the, I don't, the shared I don't, experiences with the father. Course. It would be more memorable to them. I mean, not, if this is the initial right after the news comes, then yeah, yeah no, it doesn't matter. I want my girl there. Yeah. Even if she's never met him, that's mm-hmm. irrelevant. Yeah. I'm in pain because I, I suffered a loss. Mm-hmm. I want my significant other to, to console me, first and foremost. And, okay. then my, and then my best friend, she's next up. Yeah. Like if, if, if that's what, if, if the, my next best friend after my girl uh, like is there, then yeah, she's next, he or she's next up as yeah. the second person. But even if it was a dude, like even if it was my man who's I've been, who, who I knew, even long, like I mean, guy, like male best friend or female friend, yeah. best friend, that doesn't matter. So doesn't even matter. Like, I always want my significant other there more so than a yeah. friend because we have a deeper connection together. So you would be upset if, if she was like, "Yeah, I go. I want to go to this. This is my best. Fr- like, he's she, my, you're she, my, you're my best friend now. But he is like, we have this history, this shared history, and he needs me right now. I want to go. Would you be upset if she said she was go- wanted to like go- I'm going if. She- I said she can go to the funeral. Not, not even. No, 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 it's she, not even about said you can go. I'm just asking. I'm changing. I'm giving you another scenario based on the scenario. She said we she wants with. to go for three. She's four like, days. I want to go for three, four days. I'm not gonna go for four days. I will go for two and a half days. I mean, I don't want you to fly. I'm in. I'm trying to com- no, no, compromise. I'm saying, no, no, with you. no. I'm saying I'm not, I don't want you to fly in and then go to the funeral and then fly out that same, and do everything in one day. I'm not yeah. saying that. But but yeah, I'm going to no, help. There's set no more up. than two days. Like let's say yeah. let's say you leave on Friday. Uh-huh. You leave early on Friday. Let's say the funeral's Friday, and then or Saturday, yeah. and you you fly in early. You spend Friday with him and his the rest of his family. Oh, right. yeah. You go to the funerals uh, the next day, and then you leave that night. You you hang out at the rese- the repast after that or whatever, and then you leave after that. There's I'm no- thinking more of like the funerals on Saturday. Uh-huh. She flies in Thursday, spends Thursday. Help set it up, like get go talk to the people. I mean, does it, Friday? Does this person have no help, other family member? You, that you, I'm asking. Basic, you. no. This is now. She's like his last family member now. Wow. <laughs> yeah, I, I, in, in this day and age of social media and the internet, I feel that you can do all that stuff remotely anywhere that you are, and she can, she can, she can honestly say, "Yo, I'll be if, if the funeral's Saturday and this is Thursday. Mm-hmm. Yo, I'm gonna do as much as I can on my end to set up, make sure the body, da 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 da, have the flowers, set up food arrangements because there's the internet, and I yeah. can go on the internet and set all this stuff up. So when I come through, it's all it's all it's already been set up. So mm-hmm. I we can just you know mourn together so, and so and I'm saying like so your answer would be that you would be upset with her saying yes I want to go spend the three days or four days I'm saying she's saying yes I'm going that's it what can you do after that you just got to deal with it got to deal with it or yeah. you are is this, uh, is this, yeah, a, no, is this like, a breaking I, point here is, is this is this a breaking point that you want to no. Like, no 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 it's not a breaking point because nah, it reminds me of another it. question an age old question okay. and it, like it's the same kind of vein like mm-hmm. your your girl, your significant other gets a call, and the call is like your ex boyfriend just died, and she is devastated. Your what? Your ex boyfriend just died. Yeah, and she's devastated. She's devastated. Like I mean, she's cr- would, like she is. I give her. I give her the five crying. minutes. I give her her five. No, no, minutes. no, no, no. She is balling. Devast- balling on the floor. All right, I'll give her the I day. Mean, no, I don't. I'll give her the day. Everyone deserves that. I mean. 
it shouldn't be ha- it should like, unless unless y'all were like married or and like they dated for they dated for five years like that. they dated for five years and yeah nah she shouldn't be on the floor bawling her face out nah when died. man nobody likes people to die so yeah I mean, especially if you love die. somebody and they yeah, die yeah, yeah, I yeah. mean you, lo- you she eventually you, knew you, this you person. love them at a point but I feel that when that relationship's over the, it's a, you have a different type of love that you always want them to 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 you ultimately want them to be happy and stuff like that but if they die it's sad I'm not saying you're not gonna be sad but like sobbing for days on end is that what you're saying they're sobbing for like I'm saying like a, the, the day one day yeah. they're like completely like they're done there's nothing they can do for you they're mm-hmm. done to the world yeah wow. nah I don't, I don't like she's locked I in the room know. crying everything's making her cry yeah nah I don't yo I don't, you guys be careful with, be careful cry. with Crump yo he's it's too easy for him to detach emotions from everything like y'all, be, y'all gotta be careful around this kid yeah. giving me Dexter vibes I mean no it's it's if, unless if you're doing that then I don't think you were over the person then mm. we have something to talk about. Or maybe they just love big. Nah, man, I mean, they just what? really knew maybe this person. Maybe they just love big. They that knew was this their... person. Yeah. What, if mean, they, what if they? I've, you have to. You have to be crying. You have to be bowling over over the littlest things for me to believe that's what you're doing. Nah, when people man. die. Maybe they. Just, some people get very emotional when people die. I mean, you might just be one of not be one of those people. I do get emotional okay. when people die. I lost a love with. I lost my dad when I was fourteen. So maybe that makes it a little different when it comes to people dying. Maybe. So you don't think I mean, you would cry if you lost an ex? I no. No exes would make you cry. No exes would make me ball out. Friends and be out of commission. Friends for a day. die. Yeah. Out of commission I'm, for a day. Yeah, I'm. I'm gonna. I'm definitely gonna want to be to myself. Okay. You're not gonna want to be with somebody else. Other I mean, friends that have a mutual what, friendship. What, what, I like however I'm feeling at the moment is how I'm feeling at the moment. But I'm gonna feel sad that a one of my friends much, because huh? that relationship is. Like, is that relationship is still an intact relationship? Uh-huh. Um, an ex is not a still ongoing relationship. So that I sh- I severed that relationship at a point, and mm-hmm. and time has healed that wound if there was a wound. Okay. And yes, I feel bad that the person died because I'm I feel bad that any I hear anybody dies earlier than they should have died. But you ain't balling. But I'm not balling because that's because. That would be that would mean that there's something still there mm. for that person, in I my opinion. It. I understand that. Bleak, anything extra? Um, put any sauce no, to put no, on yeah, that? I mean, yeah. Like, like I said, I'll give it a day. I, she she deserves a day. Everyone does. Uh, so I won't be mad if she's crying about it. I understand. I mean, yeah. She knew this someone person. died. Yeah, someone died. I don't. You know, if that's to... my girl. I would know what she, what this person meant to her. Usually, people speak about that. Yeah. In relationships. Yeah, you would you would you would kind of be have a heads up like okay this person oh yeah geez. it's kind of like the whole thing with the best friend as well like if that's her best friend and her best friend is the one calling her to come down like you obviously know this person because if you've been in a relationship with her for a certain amount of time I think you will know her best friend so mm-hmm. so um yeah you do know her ex so you know her ex and uh, that was the one right before you. And, you know, they had a weird breakup like this. Maybe this he did her dirty, but, you know, she still had mad love for him, but she had to yeah, he might have done her through that or whatever. Yeah, he might have done certain things. Yeah, he like, just did, he just, you know, maybe he had a problem, like an issue, like a drug mm-hmm. issue or something like that. You feel me? Doesn't so, necessarily make him a bad person. Yeah, you well, know that, what I mean? Like, that, so opinion, she had feel, to get away from it. I, yeah. feel, I feel in that, in my opinion, that There's changes kind of it. Scenarios. That changes the whole thing, in my opinion. How does it? What, what because do it goes from just being... About loving them and missing them, if they're just boohooing that they died, to you help them get over something traumatic, and yeah, that's, that's why. But I'm not even saying it, like, connection. see, I'm just there's trying. To, I'm trying to give you another kind of aspect of it because you completely. There, right? No, I'm saying, I'm saying that changes com- it. I'm no, saying that changes it. It doesn't change know. it because the question was, the question was, their ex dies and they're crying and they're t- distraught yeah. over it. Yeah. Are you? How do you feel about that? And you are saying that's out of control. I mean, you didn't say. So, you didn't, I don't have you to give you that I'm just that saying part. you're not. I, I'm basing it off of what's at least given to me, and I yeah, think and what, given, if it if it's nothing other than they just broke up, yeah. then yeah, if you're crying over the person boohooing, but there's always going to be context to to everything. You pass it to me. I did. Yeah. There's oh, always going to be context high, to everything. We baked God again. Damn. Back to back. I, I just passed it. So ma- nah, you sure? it's me. Yeah, oh. Nah. Right. God damn. We got to cut that out. All right, so back to what we were talking about. Yeah, no, I, I, I think that changes it. For me, that changes it. Like, if it's something super specific that they went through or something, that, that could change it. it. Depends on what it is. This is what I'll be talking about, though, Crump. Like, this is what I'll be talking about. Like, the question is set up in general. You have to put your, yeah, your, it, it, your, it really minds, your mindset is... So, like, all right, so once again, the question was, 
if your ex, ex she, your your girlfriend, your significant other, uh-huh. gets a phone call that her ex, ex dies, dies and she's distraught over it. Yeah, exactly. Of course, there's context to it. It can't just be like your ex dies, like. Damn. Oh, some nigga, and I'm crying. Yeah, man. Like, you, they were the ex, so there's yeah. gonna be something. I mean, to are you crying? You know, are, are you? Are you? Is what, it, are you crying? Like, so basically, the question is is is, is: is 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 said significant other crying over every single ex that she that has died, or is this a spe- special ex? This just what, this is the only time it's happened. I'm I'm a, I'm asking you. You've never. She's saying, never. She never had another I'm, ex I'm die. In, in this scenario that you're creating, yes. if if there was multiple exes that died, is she crying over all exes? Or is it nah, this, this was one in time. particular? No, this one time. I'll answer this question. I don't understand the relevance at it's all. It's just one time right no now. no relevance it, it helps at me all. answer the question. She's crying over all recent exes that were like a long period of time. Like, Significant like, exes. Like if any ex dies while y'all are together, is she crying over Not them? any ex. The ones that she dated for five plus years. Oh, well then, yeah. That may, See, there's differences. There's, that. Yeah, but why wouldn't you automatically think that if the question is her ex dies and she's crying? Wouldn't it be because they have a, a close relationship? Wouldn't that automatically be entered into your head? I, like, not, you take not, emotion out of everything. <laughs> like, when you answer yeah. the question, it's your answers. But I feel like you just completely take emotion away from it. Like, oh, why would she ever have feelings for somebody else? That doesn't make sense. Because she's a human being. Yeah. I mean, you have feelings for multiple people. You can still love somebody but not be in love with them. No, you, you can have having a, love for somebody and yes. being in love are two are showing two different types of emotions. That's what I'm saying. So you can still I mean, love. So th- those are still, two different types of actions. And you can cry for somebody you love. Nah, yeah, you can care for someone. You man. can cry over somebody. You can cry over yeah. a thing that you I, love. You can you care don't for still things. love the person and not necessarily. What's the difference yeah. between being in love and, not, and just loving somebody? What's the difference? To be in like, love, like to, and just to have love for somebody and want. Good for I'm, somebody. You keep saying have love. Just, just under this, par- just for me. Like, it, like for under me, parameter. So for, for, for me, being for in love and loving someone. You yeah. can love somebody and you, be I, in love with. You them. can do both. No, yeah, there's I, two different things. I, I, then, At the same then there's time, there's three. Then y'all are forgetting the, the the other one where you're just having love for people because I feel like I having love is just I, the, a way of saying I'm polite exes, to somebody. Like any of my exes, like I, I can, have love for them and I want to see them do great, but I'm not still in love with them. Okay. Or I still don't love them. But why do you keep saying I still have, don't love them? The, you, I'm, I don't love them. I feel like you have a that's pro- active to me that's active. That's fine. Yeah. That's a verb. It's 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 something I'm not actively doing that. Exactly. So that's why I'm saying I have love for them and I want to see them do good. But, but having love, love for them. somebody would be loving them. No. How could it not be? Because I'm if, if they call me to do something, I'm not gonna do So I'm what's the difference between having them. love for somebody and loving I don't somebody? What's see the them. difference between those two things? One is just from from afar, I just want to make sure. I, not make sure. I just hope nothing bad happens to you. Yeah. And then one is, if you call me, I'm actively. If you call me for some help, I'm actively doing it. Is that more like caring I'm not for someone? Gonna, if you call me for something, you might care for because someone. of like, right? If you call me to do something, I'm not. I'm not necessarily gonna do that. For 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 some, if not all, my exes. You know what I mean, especially in the positions and 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 areas and areas of life that they so might be. So you say in. so you would you would you would break down. Your affection for people in three categories. Okay. I mean, we're talking about in exes, love, not love, people. Ex, ex, I mean, there's, there's, there's different qualities. For I exes, mean, you would break it down in three categories. Yeah. Being in love with them, uh-huh. loving them, and having love for them. Okay. Yeah, I think, I think yeah, I, I guess. I guess. I guess, uh, like, I guess. I just know that if they're an ex, I have yes. love for you. You have love for them, but you don't love them. No. Oh, man. So if they died, not, you wouldn't be upset. You wouldn't feel any kind of way. I, I'd feel bad because... Would you the cry? Person? Do you think you could cry for an I ex? don't think I'd cry. Okay. Hmm. Do you think you could have a connection with somebody that would be an ex that you could cry for? Yeah. Uh, not currently. Is it a possibility, you think? I mean, I haven't experienced it. I haven't I haven't had an ex that if they personally, like... But could you see it as a possibility? No. Nah. Okay. Okay. Anything bleak? <laughs> emotionless. Like, I'm not emotionless. Yes, you are, my nigga. To me, it's like three different That's levels. That's emotionless? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> nah, it's like three different levels. You can How can you, right, s- love how can you someone? cut off emotions like that? I'm not, it's, I said, I. You can break up with somebody. I explained, I explained still, in the answer earlier. I said, with time heals wounds if there are wounds. Like, yes, in time. He did say that. I'm That's, not. But he did say let, that, though. Yeah. What? No, no, it's so good to talk Yeah, but what, about I'm saying, like. Don't about it. What if it's not about wounds? Sometimes yeah. you can have a mutual breakup and y'all still love each other. I want the best for you. Mm-hmm. I care about you. If there's anything I can do for you, I will yeah. do it for you to a certain you know, boundary because we are not together. Nah, some people don't experience that. I haven't experienced that. Yeah. Okay. But do you see that as a possibility in life or do you think that's ludicrous? 
Do you think that that's absurd? I mean, to I, think that that I, I feel that situation I feel, I feel can those, exist. Is that I feel, absurd? I feel if that's the the type of relationship you have, that the door is not necessarily closed on your relationship on possibly getting together. So you, so if you love somebody, that means the doors are no, open. No, I think the the way you set it up, or, or or the scenario that you presented, I don't think I think those I think there's a chance that those two people could ultimately get back together. And I'm talking in situations where you're never going to get back together with the person. I'm I I got love for you, and I want to make sure that I, I hope all the best for you. But we don't have any active co- communication, no active communication, yeah. because we 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 closed the the door on that type of on that relationship. Mm-hmm. So if I saw you in trouble or in pain, yeah, I'd help you because I want to see you do good, and I lo- and I love, and that's the sense of I love you. If you're in if you're in pain and shit yeah. like that, yeah, I'll come through real quick. But I'm not. We don't have an active. Commun- we don't have active uh, lines of communication. I feel like you don't even have to have active lines of communication to love people. Like you love your great aunt, you don't ever I, fucking call her. I mean, I do. I'm not. No, I'm not saying you specifically. <laughs> no, I'm just like, saying. You know what I'm but, saying? Like, but, yeah, yeah. but there's like cousins the, you don't talk to in like a long true. time. You it's love true. the shit out of them. Yes, it's true. So it's, it's not true. about contact. I feel like yeah, but you're, that, you feel but like but it's the, inappropriate. But that's something that that's something that's different. Because mm-hmm. we're tied together from blood, we we chose to join in a relationship together, and we chose to end the relationship. So it's not like family's an ongoing thing. Like there's no friendship is an ongoing thing. I mean, we we were in a romantic relationship, and if we want to choose to be friends after that, then cool, we're friends, and we love each other as friends. Yeah, but that same. But I'm saying love. But doesn't so don't, have so, don't to be... so don't throw it in the same category as the love as in your relationship. But I'm not. I'm just not... saying the word love. You're automatically well, well, attributing I'm to, to I'm, it. I'm sorry. I'm trying yeah. to be a little more specific, and and no, but but and, and, now and, and we're as clear. I'm trying to and be now as we're clear. Down. So you don't think that I'm I'm that because the way I'm taking it and the way I'm interpreting it is that. There's a possibility that romantically we, those two people can go can get back together. Maybe that's just how you're seeing the word love. Once you hear the word love, that's how you're seeing it. Okay. I mean, if we're talking about so people who were in a relationship, so, so you feel right. I me? Mean? Like, yeah, yeah, that's cool. Wow, wow, that was uh, that was crazy. That was a kind of deep conversation right there. I didn't expect that. <laughs> how did that happen? I know that was good, Crump. Oh man, I didn't do anything. <laughs> <laughs> Crump, no feelings, 2020. Yeah. I have feelings. <laughs> do you? Yeah, yeah. he just Crump, you know? Crump. Do you do you love your friends, Crump? Yeah. Okay. Okay. <laughs> but like that's not as active as that. I mean, I'm doing this active? podcast. Oh. oh. There you oh. go. Throw them hearts up. Charity. Throw them hearts up. You're being magnanimous. <laughs> there you go. Yeah. Bing. Very charitable. Mm, you earned you earned that. To dig. Let's go. Anything in the news, guys, before I get into some more bullshit? Oh man. Uh you know, Puerto Rico, the earthquake, six point four, a couple schools, houses. It's tough out there in the world right now. Yeah, man. It's a lot of Anything else? On. Anything like what? Australia, Any actual, like uh, current Australia. events. Australia, man, don't play with that, man. You. Why do people play with news like that, man? You. They put so out that um, I, um a that question, shit viewer from question. Australia. That shit was fake, bro. That shit was trash. That image. That shit is whack because real shit is happening and then people are over here playing and like posting fake shit. That's not, that's not, you know, that's not real. That's not what's up. My fault. Just want to say that. That's all good. Yeah, that shit was trash. Do you think? No, nah, yeah. It's just... uh, I got a viewer question, mm-hmm. right? What is the maximum spending limit for a first date? Maximum spending limit on the first date. And then I would like to maybe that question and then like a follow-up question right after that. Like what what are your like your <coughs> rules for a first date if you have any? Like do's and don'ts, cannot do, will do. First date. Try to put yourselves in that mindset. First date. First, first date. You fire something that you this has been I refuse to be driven. On a first day. <laughs> what do you mean driven? Oh, oh driven. Least, yeah, like you gotta drive. I, that's what I stand against. That no, I will drive. What about on yeah, the first date? I'm you, sorry. Are you okay? Equal with, rights. Let me drive. Are you okay with meeting up there? Meeting at the spot? Yeah, like we both drive. Oh yeah, whatever. Yeah, I like that. But she can't drive you. She can't pick you up. Yeah, she can't pick and me open up. your door. No, nah. I I, I, I work. Nah. I make my own money. I can Ain't open my own doors. That. Okay. I, I, that's you know, I don't think there's nothing wrong with that. I've I've been picked up before on first dates. What about you? 
Uh, your question? Yeah. Being picked up on the first day, how do I feel about yeah. that belief system? Yeah. Because, uh, you know, the original question is what's the spending limit on the day? Right, right, but, Okay. Right. We're getting uh, girl picking me up? Can she send you a ride? Yes, she can. Send um, the Uber, baby. Send the Uber. It's cool. I'll be there in three minutes. The Uber said it. Yeah, she can send me the Uber. She's paying for the Uber. Like, everything's all good. It's all good. Oh, no. Then no, she can't. She you can't. have to pay for the Uber. Yeah, I'm good. I'll, I'll buy my own Uber, if anything. Okay. So you get there. Like, she has. She can't help you in getting there in any way. No. Okay. No, nah, she can send me the Uber. And she can pick you up. Oh, yeah. she can, I've been picked up. I, I agree with My Bleak God. completely and wholeheartedly. <laughs> yeah, we're going on a date. I don't care how we get there. As yeah. long as we're cool getting we're cool, there and there was bro. no stress getting there, we're good. Yeah. You feel me? Sounds, I don't nah, know, man. Don't you. Can't be insecure, you know? You got to yeah. gotta be you. Do you want to expound on why she can't pick you up? Is there like a, something that we need to learn? Maybe there's a lesson I didn't learn yet and you could put me on. Yeah, sure, I sure. Mean, it's 2020. Exactly. It's 2000. Oh, I Don't get picked Uber. up, nigga. Oh shit. I can. I'm, it's 2020. I could buy my own Uber. So this is what's yeah. like equal rights. I could rights. do that. Yeah, you know I mean? But okay. I. But I will take the gift. Okay. But I will take a gift. Okay. I won't say no to a gift. Okay. I can't pay for my Uber. So what's the what's the spending limit on a first date? First date. This is somebody. Like how much? That, how much she spending on? Let me, me give you some more date? context because you you say you need the context. Like how much she spends on me on the first date? Your what is your spending limit? Oh. On a first date. You really like this girl. She's very attractive to you. Who asked who out? You asked her out. Oh. Okay. And then we can do she asked you out. But yeah. you asked her out. Okay. Okay? What is your spending limit? And kind of give me... You really like this girl. This is wow. Like You're like, whoa, guys. She's... <laughs> you know? I don't really, that cats I don't me out. I don't think there's really a limit... Like, I'm not going overboard, but I, I think we're just going to enjoy the night. I, I what really if she has know. exotic taste? What is exotic taste? Uh, expensive taste. Mm. But she's poo poos on the restaurant I'd take her to? Where you, oh, okay. So, no. okay. So, she wants the, noble. Take she me with noble. you. Like, is that what you mean? No, no, no. Hold on, hold on. Take me she with you. She want to go to I mean, noble. I'm on just saying, whatever, whatever, rest, me, whatever restaurant hold I choose. Hold on, hold on. Whatever hold restaurant I choose to hold take on, her to. Hold on, let me, okay. So, what what kind of restaurant would you take? What level? Like, what are we doing here? Well, I'm going to definitely have a conversation with her to find out what kind of food she likes to see what, I mean, what kind of spices. No banja. Stuff like that. No no banja. And then make an appropriate decision based off of those answers that she gives me. Okay, but like, what's the. Like the price range. I mean, it, there's no like obviously it's nothing to be cheap, but it doesn't really matter what the. What, what if the she's like, yo, I love. Can I, I can say names of places, right? Do you want to say names of places? <sighs> yeah, fuck it. Say names of types of food. She loves Cheesecake oh. Factory. God's sake. Jeez, that's cheap. Uh, as fuck. That's cheap. <laughs> cheesecake Factory. That's that's I'll take my niece there or some shit. <laughs> um, like uh, she wants to go to one of those restaurants that you know. At the end of everything, the bill but for you two that? is going to be one fifty, two hundred. She, 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 she specifically says like she likes going to these restaurants. She'd be like, "Yo, I really like the way they do a steak over here." At, oh, like that's, that's my that? favorite like spot. If you're asking me where I want to go, oh no, 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 I'm I, I'm never asking her where she wants to go. I'm just I'm just we're just having a conversation. Getting oh, so she's like, I love steaks and chops uh, and lobster and shit like that. That's okay. what I. Love. Okay. Well, yeah. Like that kind of I'll seafood a, or, or like a nice steakhouse. That's what I like. She want to go to Seafood City? Ooh, I'll, I'll, I'll take it to a nice place. Okay. Price range? Because um, this is about the spending limit. So I just want, I, I want you guys to take me with you on a first date. Like, wow. are you trying to save money? What is it? Are you trying to talk to her more? Are you trying to impress? Like, what are, what's the vibes? Well, I mean, I'm, I'm just trying to make sure she has a, a wonderful time. Yeah, the vibes is with so, the chick, right? Um, yeah. That's my answer. Yeah. Yeah, that was. Gotcha. I feel like you just jumped out of everything right there. Oh like, no, I mean no. I'm just saying, like, I'm not gonna take me with you on a first date. You take her. You going to a restaurant? Is that what you're doing? You are going to eat? Yeah, we're going to eat. Okay, so we're going to eat, and then that's it. Like, we're gonna go eat. I mean, we're gonna go. Talk, we're gonna eat. We're gonna. You like mean? her a lot. Okay. Remember, I'm, I'm, I'm. I started with that. I mean, we're we're going to a, a, a nice steak spot. Are you staying in the city? Are you staying in the city? I mean, we're going to wherever I want to take her. <laughs> We're going to El Conde Steakhouse, yeah? Fire. <laughs> okay. Holla. Nah. Where you, where you taking her? She likes more food. Me? Yeah. I'll see what the vibes yeah. are, because maybe it, eating like a real sit-down restaurant, it might not even, I might not even have to do all that. Right. It could be... That's, that's why I said I'm, I, I'd, you talk, know what I mean? I'd, I'd see where her... But when it comes to spending limit, I am not spending more than a couple hundred dollars, unless this is like... What if she 
she wasn't yeah, like, man. I think th- for me, like in all, like for, for me, the whole day, like two hundred and fifty dollars for the whole day. Or this is OD. Were you just was the original question the the date itself or like spending limit on a first date? Oh, first date. Okay. Okay, yeah. So I'm trying to look at all the ways it could right, be. Right, right, yeah. right, right, right. 300. Yeah. 300. That's the team. Yeah, like 250, 300 the most for the whole day. I don't even want to spend that. I want to spend $100. Okay. Hell right. oh, yeah. But, you take her out on Tuesday, $5 ticket, $5 movie Tuesday. You take her on $5 movie Tuesday. That's five. That's $8. I feel like movie is such a bad thing. Yeah, I mean, it don't matter. I, I Girls feel, like I, movies. I just, feel, I just feel like Girls the, like the money, the, the... Girls. Yeah, first... Man. First date movies is not the yeah, best you idea. Get, I don't think you, I had, you don't get to talk. You don't get to talk. Man, to think it in a solid. What if you're, what if she, she can't pick you up, she can't send you over. Can she pay the bill? Can she pay the bill? Nah. We gotta. Oh, so so you invite a woman no, no, out. I I feel if I invite honestly, if, if I invite a woman out. So what if you invite a, gotta, gotta, gotta what if what if you on. invite the woman out? If she wants to pay, then we can split. Let it her pay if she, if she wants to pay. That she wants to pay something. Wouldn't you want me can, to ask she you she this can, question? Either give the tip. She give the tip. If she wants to give more than the tip, pay a woman she wants if you want to pay. The thing because what? obviously she wants to give a lot of. She wants to give money up. So so what? Uh, Left was just talking to you about what he said. He said that so what if le- she offered to pay the bill? Le- uh, so you invite her out. Engineer Left was like, yo, what if... Uh... So you invited her out. Yeah. But she wants to pay, and she's adamant about it. She, I'm paying for it. She's adamant about paying for it. So, like, I told her, I invited you out, so this is on me. But if she's adamant about paying something, I told her she can leave the tip. And if she wants to leave more than the tip, mm-hmm. then that's whatever she wants to leave. Yeah. Like... I'm about to care What if about some shit she like gets up to go to the bathroom, she's like, and she pays for the shit. The nigga never even brings the receipt. Like he never even brings the check. He's just like, thank you. Well then I, I wasn't even given the choice to make a decision. Are you giving her money or you're like, listen, that We're was gonna have a conversation. Was, I'm gonna be like, I'm that was wild tight. I was I'll I'm, t- upset. I'll, I'm gonna tell her that I invited you out and it I not that like I, I guess you have to say you appreciate it, but um Are you gonna put out? Am I putting out because she bought dinner? No, I'm just saying, like, do you feel like, Yo, wow, man. she took that? If, like, she, if she wants to pay, <laughs> man, huh? if she wants to pay, she pays. That's it. She want. I mean, what the fuck am I gonna argue with her for? She throws the car, she throws the car before me. Oh, all right. And then I, you know, did you hesitate, did no, you hesitate I, with the card at all? Or no, no, nah. nah, she just put it out right away, like uh, right away. She just had it. So I throw my like, card. Yeah, she just, uh. she slaps her card. I slap my card too. All right, we're going half, half it is. That's how it is. Nah, nah, nah. ain't nothing wrong with that. This I seen hella memes, hella memes of joints that say that if mm-hmm. any nigga goes half of me on first dates and all this shit, ego. Yo, man, shut up. Uh, I mean, we can get into if that. It's gonna go there anyway. Um, girls so, always do that, bro. Hold on, yeah. Girls paying for for shit Ain't is no that. issue. Yeah, no me. issue. No. Girls like to pay for shit, and that's fire. None. They can pay for shit too. Sometimes. Yeah. I like to pay for shit. I like to pay for things. Sometimes it makes me feel good. But I like to get things paid for for me. That feels good too. Yeah. Well, so we're it's about a the first date. But the first date, yeah, first I said date. I would like to pay. First date. Especially if I asked her out. Because, yeah, you know, so, in the so, premise so that I paid, asked her out. So she paid, if she paid it before you had a chance. Well, I'd be pleasantly surprised. And I'd be you, happy would you, about what that. Would you, uh, would you ever mention it? Give her, offer her any money? What? I'm taking her out again. And I'm making sure I pay. Uh-huh. Like, there's no way. What you if she does it. it again? If she goes again, the, the, the way I'm doing it next time, she can't do it again. I'm paying for everything in advance. Like, we go in to a thing, and I paid for it. I, said, I already paid if, for it, What stupid. if she's like, yo, actually, let's not go to that spot. I got a new spot with you, too. Yeah. And it does it again. Oh, my God. Three times. Yeah, I might have to wife. <laughs> That's mommy Warbucks. Yeah, yeah. dig. Uh, <laughs> dig. You heard yeah, me? <laughs> I'm down with that. Oh, yeah. Yeah, man, it's cheap. I, you got to put out, right? Yes, sir. That's how that works, right? <laughs> She's buying the steaks. You got to. You got to put out. So, how do you out. feel about that? How do you feel about that? Because that's a question. It, it gives me two fire questions. Okay. okay. The first question is. Mm-hmm. Like, if you're paying for extravagant things for a female that she's asking for, yeah. right? Not just, like, out of your own whim. Like, she's asking for it. Do you think that you're entitled to some reciprocation for that? No, because... Like, she's I, asking, like, yo, can we go to fucking Hawaii and wild out and see this and see that yeah, and stay I just, together? I like, would just drop Does that she joint. have to... I would drop that joint. Does she have to... I'm dropping that joint. No, but you. I'm saying you like her for the sake of the. No, no, but I, I feel I do like her, but like, you're not gonna guilt me into uh, 
It's, it's not a guilt. Like she's just asking you. Like yeah, no, nah, I don't want to. I don't want to give it to you. No, you're not. Giving like whatever it. she calls you, she's gonna come up to you like mm, crumpy. Yeah, nah. Can you take me to Honolulu for six days? No. And what? She's gonna leave? Nah, she's just gonna be upset. All right, yeah, she can be upset. But if you did do that for her, do you think that you would be ob- she would be obligated to reciprocate that with physical activity? Nah, she's not obligated. She asked for it, and you obliged. So there's no you like said, you didn't say that. You don't think it would time. be you don't think it would be the the considerate thing to do. Like I mean, the, you you said the right thing to do. The, the, you, well, now you're saying considerate, but you said no. You feel do like you, she's obligated. Yeah, like to. Do, you, do you think that she I should? Think she's do you think she to. should do it? I mean, not be like j- no, not on that alone. No, you a- just because she asked you to take her some what. Somewhere? No, I'm saying like you're spending large amounts of money I mean, on her. You, yeah, you choose to spend those large amounts of money on her. I, I, for things I that she's asking you for. Yeah, I'd be like, nah, shorty, you can't get, you can't, we're not going there this, this time. Okay. Or we're not going, right. we're not doing that. <laughs> you want to go there? Bet. Say, all right, cop the tickets then. Oh, she, okay. So she if you want to go the there, you know what I mean? You, everything good, Blake? You good? Oh, hell yeah. Uh, okay. We back. We back. We had your friend here chilling for a second. Oh yeah, that's yeah, what's doing up. Doing his thing. Yeah, he came through. You know I mean? He always does. Yeah, but anyway, so uh, the question was. Yeah. You want to set it up for him? Um, the question was. Brrr, chicka, 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 chicka. Um, oh I shit! Forgot. Yeah. All right. That's good though. Set him up. That means we're smoking some good shit. Yeah. Right. Let's like Black, uh, Black Mamba OG. That's how we do it. So, um, it's a first date question. Oh, okay. Is it the same? Oh, we're, we're, no, he answered that question. No, yeah. but what's, what was the, what if was you the spend, new part of if it? you're, it's like, it's like yeah, a, fr- a new relationship. Was 300, yeah. Okay, so this, the question that we were asking right now is mm-hmm. if you're spending large amounts of money on yeah. a female because she's asking for it, things that she's asking she's for. She's asking you to oh, take her to Hawaii. Like she wants to go on trips, oh, she you're wants a pinko. Space, whatever, and you're, yeah, yeah. You know, she's like, you know, please. Yeah, you're a pinko. Okay. Please. Are you obligated? Uh, is she obligated to perform sexually? Do you think that she's obligated to sexually? To, to, you? Of course. What? What do you mean she's obligated? She has to perform sexual oh, actions. I mean, come on. I'm not. Actions. And not in a creepy way. Like, come not on. I'm paying all this way. money. Of exactly. course. Exactly. Not, not in a creepy aren't way. Grateful? Aren't you grateful? I mean, yeah, she don't, thanks, it's not necessarily babe. mean that she has she to just pay says me thanks, back babe, in and then sex. like goes on I'm regular. not saying that. No, because maybe my love, your love language is gifts. But I would like some attention. And my love language, I would like some attention. Is, is what I would say. Physical, physical what? Times. Uh, but physical action. So maybe she, that's what she's obligated. She's obligated to. Uh, no, I to, would like some attention. Is what I would say. What if she's like, nah, just thanks, babe. I think wow. it would be the considerate would thing you, to would do. You, would you that would not, lead would you, me would you, to believe if that she did it, she's would only you, with me would, for the money. Would you not so. get her that anymore? Would you, would you? Yes, I would stop. Because yeah, then that would lead yeah, me to believe that some of these she's guests. a chapiadora. Uh, no? and she's a choppy? She's a choppy. Choppy. <laughs> and I'm a panko because I fell for it. So I'm out of there. Maybe you're just being magnanimous. I'm just not. I'm just not. In this going situation, for fire, you're up baby. Baby. I'm not going for those type of joints. The question is not about going for the joint. The question is, you're already with the joint. You like the joint. Is she obligated to reciprocate large uh, monetary gifts? Of course. And I feel like, yeah, give and take, man. Why don't you I'm want someone like that? Why yeah. don't you want to be equal? I feel like women hold men right into these high standards at all times. But as soon as we do, we're some kind of assholes or some shit. We're we're not like we're not really the ones. Right, we're not balling. We're not nothing. As soon as we ask for half, or as soon as we ask for some contributions, like get the fuck out of here. Like, be real, man. You you want equal equality, right? In yeah. relationships. So, I, I saw this. Uh, ar- I saw this news article where they were talking. Uh, well, news report where uh, they were talking about how women are starting to make uh, more money than men, mm-hmm. and they're not. Uh, in some. In some. In some. Don't. Well, I feel so like they fired. do already. Why wouldn't that be fire? Oh. If you're my like partner, per- right. yeah. So I ultimately they were saying that women who make uh, more than the average man, they don't want to date down because they don't want to have to like uh, they don't they don't want to like buy like the men stuff. 
They don't want to be the the, the breadwinners, the primary breadwinner. Yeah, yeah. They they they're calling it dating down. They don't want to. They want to. They want to date somebody on their level or higher. That's what I'm saying. So, you see that? So that's being on right, they want to hold men to, to higher standards. That's, 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 that's what they. That's the way okay. they were. Uh, so that's a good example. Uh, what I'm saying. That's the way those people look at it. And good luck on their dating yeah, journey. Yeah, fuck you. Good luck. That's what I say. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck yeah, that. good luck on your dating journey Fuck with that you. way. That's gonna be it's gonna be interesting. And you might get lucky. Good luck for you and hopefully that works out. I feel like money is not the main, you know? That's not the that shouldn't be the primary focus right there. Yeah, it's true, man. It's not Personally. women are fighting for equality, so here it is. Yeah. Okay. And then the other part of that question with the uh, you know, spending limit the other way was if you uh uh, meet a girl first date everything's rocking you like yeah. her everything's crazy great situation uh-huh. and she gives it up to you like right yeah. away and it, it's 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 really good it's fire fire Ooh. everything that you like the way you Damn. like it three hours of that pumping can you continue Back shots. can you how do you feel about that trabaja cavando oh. digging can you digging in the- can you wipe that can you oh, can you move forward I like I mean I'm one I said but of the first night uh yeah Intercourse, mm-hmm. the and it was, and it was, relations. and it was, sexual relations, and it was amazing. Sexual, it was magnificent. Magnificent. Yeah. Uh, I mean, definitely consider it. Chicka chicka wow wow. I'd, I'd have to see. I'd have to see. I'd have to play it. It wouldn't be completely wiped so away. Yes, she, she, so yes, you could consider it. Yes, yes you I, could yes, do it. Yes. I, you could it. do it in a, in a situation. Depending on the situation, I could do it. It's possible. Yeah, it's so yes. Yeah. That's what that is, right? That's, that's, how, that's how... Possibly, depending on the situation. That's all you have to do. I mean, I, wanna, I don't to want me, the show to be bad That's all you have to do. Quick. That's how you do it. I want, the, I, want to, I want to fill it up. I feel you. Mm-hmm. But Bleak. Yeah. Mm. Same question. I just... I'm sprung... You could wife it? Hey. You could wife it? No, we on Spotify now. We can't. The, oh, the, the chill, chill, chill. baby. Oh, we on Spotify, baby. Chill, chill, chill baby. Right, we on Spotify. Call, yeah, yeah. 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 Chill out, chill out, chill out. Oh, you Spotify. Listen, yeah, chill out, um, chill out. I mean, that YouTube, just means I'm YouTube, sprung, YouTube, obviously, YouTube. right? Of course. First day, so we go for four hours, breaking backs, chairs, sweat. Crazy. Everything oh. you like. Everything, everything you like, everything you didn't have to tell her. Yeah. She already was doing it. Damn, nah. Yeah, well, automatically you want a wife, of course. Yeah. Wifey. 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 And you said you could see a, pr- a possibility, see a possibility. Yeah. but probably not. But you could see a possibility. Nah, right man. There. It's so much funner when you jump all yeah, the way in. Yeah, see a possibility. Yeah, yeah. Okay. What, you think, what about right? you? Okay. Me? If it's that crazy and that so intense, I think we're good bread. Like, let's go for it. Hey. Why not? Hey. That's how life is. You go for yeah, it, Yeah, you right? go for it. You That's what I'm it. saying. If you just, it's so much fun when you jump all the way in. People don't like heartbreaks. Sometimes heartbreaks it comes with lessons, you know. So, yeah. you jump lesson in up. So, um, uh, though we have mad good shit, but would anything like yes. fast, like yeah. top, okay. Power talk. Power talk. Power, power, talk. power is back. back. Power talk. And we're not talking about empire. We're talking uh, ghosts. Ghost. We're talking the real ghost. The real ghost. The guy with that. So um, I mean, I uh. So that whole episode was a waste of time. I mean, it was good, but it wasn't it, <laughs> like we still don't know Anything. if ghost is alive. Or I dead. feel like it's a developing story uh, episode. I mean, and only come on, man. Res- I mean, we respect, like, man. It, it it's developing. Cool. We're it developing. It was cool to learn. I mean, the uh, the developing. events that led up to uh, how Dre got to the um the uh. The uh, nightclub, but exactly. Dre is don't, a, don't know anything. Dre is a slimy yeah, motherfucker, yo, man. Dre is a slimy nigga. Yo. He is. He's, yeah. yo, he's jump. slimy, he's, dirty, he's, dirty he guy. Might, he, might go, he goes down as one, one of, of the, the best dirty guy, yeah. in in modern like I mean network TV. Like yeah. he's he's yo he's yeah. he's a scumbag, yo. Yeah, but that he's don't make him. That don't make him the best hood villain. show villains yeah, ever. Nah, no way. He's a scumbag. Yeah, I know. But I'm looking forward to next week. Oh yeah, I, I'm I hope tuned in. I hope it's not I'm another one of those uh, just learning about how another mm. person gets to. I the, think uh, next week thing. we can really have we're some gonna, real no, power talk, but no. we just want to let y'all know it's gonna that be we know it's back, and we're gonna be talking about it. We're gonna because yeah. I know a lot of y'all watch Power. No, a lot of y'all hate Power. Still want to know. Nah, we still want to know people's theories on if Ghost is alive and who shot Ghost because nobody shot knows ghost. who shot Ghost. And just be careful. Don't go on uh, Instagram because French Montana might tell you how it ends. Yeah. 
Yo, French Montana and 50 Cent beefing. Oh, I heard about that. Isn't he is calling that? him? Isn't he calling him 59? Nah, man. Because yeah. <laughs> now like anything pump. nine is snitching. Yeah. Yo, That's man. Like see what? Yo, come on, man. That's like a son. It's out of control. For, they said, yeah, French was super fake in the streams, and oh. they said, and Fifty said that French bought a 2008 Bugatti that Pop Smoke was uh, had in his video, and Mad People had in his video, and only has a CD player. And it doesn't have uh, Bluetooth in it. You hear that? <laughs> you hear this kind of shit? <laughs> <laughs> what I always say, man, the Yo, measures that B, these rap they yeah. take, take it, man. For attention, man. These niggas I'm is funny as shit, it. though. Yeah. Funny as shit. Well, so the Bugatti, so the old Bugatti means they take extreme measures yeah. for attention. Yo, man, they so said they got a video. He posted a for video, uh, audio of uh, him talking to somebody saying that Bugatti's been in bad videos. Mm -hmm. It's been bad. So it's, it's filth. Been, yeah. so, yeah. so it's supposedly it's, filth now. The, the, it's, Fuck even though here. it's still over a million dollars, it's now it's filth. garbage it's been because touched. it's been used. It's been yeah. soiled. Yeah, you know. Uh, by who, inferior who, who rappers. These, standards? So it's, you know, these guys are crazy, that, man. I saw Lizzo got off Twitter. Or Instagram, yeah, because they don't let her be. Exchange. We did that, clearly. Yeah. That was clearly us. She's like, yo, I'm tired of the haters. Yeah, the man, you feel me? Too much hate. The truth isn't hate. The truth is in Sit hate. your big ass down. Oh, snap. I mean, get out of here, Lizzo. It's your big ass. What else? What else? What else? Oh, wait, wait, wait. What's up with um, um, Giants? Oh, come oh. On. Oh, oh, the man. Giants were stupid. Giants. We suck again. We hired a special team. Well, we're trying to hire a special teams coach to be our head coach. Yeah, yeah that sounds like Giants. How Giant did you shit. lose Mike McCarthy? How did you not want Mike McCarthy? He's trash. They probably couldn't. Why Mike would McCarthy somebody want to come here at this point? No, but why did. Why did Dallas get them and not the Giants? Because Dallas has money and they're the Dallas Cowboys. Because the Giants are the Giants are filthy right now. Time now. Yeah. New York front offices is looking crazy. The Yankees is the only thing keeping us afloat right now. This is very true. It's filth everywhere else. I don't understand. Filth, and you know the thing. What, what makes it so hard for it to get any better? Yeah, is that we just sell out anyway, so it doesn't even matter. So why would they even rush to? This is anything? the problem with New York, right? We're just gonna go to the games yeah. regardless and buy all the expensive beers and do all of that and do all the stupid Keep shit. Keep Dolan happy. Yeah, this Prison. is what this is Prison. about. Uh, Ricky Gervais killed it at the uh, Golden Globes. His uh, opening monologue. Yes, Ricky Gervais did. is a funny guy. Man. Yes, he did. He He's hit. I can't. I it's so yo ten for ten on all those jokes. 10 out of 10? 10 out of 10. Flawless victory? Flawless. Flawless Flawless, like, like, like these uh, Roddy Rich verses been flawless Ooh. recently? Yeah, just like that. <sighs> flawless victory. That boy on fire. I mean, you know what I mean? Good thing I got rid of them Brooklyn Steel tickets. <laughs> Reseller's yeah. market, baby. Get that money. That's how we do it. Okay, and moving right along. <laughs> I said Benny the Butcher. Out of control. You, you we want viewers. On yeah. You said it on the mic. <laughs> yeah, cut that shit out. Get that shit out of here. Uh, <laughs> depress people. <laughs> Who the fuck wants to hear that shit? <laughs> I thought you wanted to listen to music. Yeah, I'm you here know, to listen man. to music. Not scat. Not, <laughs> yeah. That's some ruffians. <laughs> wow. <laughs> In a dirty alley. Yeah, Light up, bleep. Yeah, yeah, talking facts. some dumb shit. Yo, man. Light up so we can take this home, man. Facts. All right, so uh, any what other uh, what other um, uh, gossipy shit? Oh, gossip since yeah, shit. let's talk some gossip, gossip girl girls shit, yeah. Gossip girls. Love um, hip hop. Let's talk about some celebrities and shit. Some yeah, gossip girl some shit. So, Y'all yo. fucking haters. Girls on the view now. No. Oh yeah, Amanda Seals is on as a as a main uh, <laughs> uh, host on uh, the talk or whatever. When I think of Amanda Seals, I think about a topic that we need to touch on in depth. What is that? Because sometimes people think we're a little bit too Talk to lax. Talk to and all we're doing is having a siphon camera. Exactly. Motherfucker, yes, we're having a siphon camera, you dumbass. This is what this is. It's the blood exchange. The fuck? But anyway, so we got to get into some serious shit. Yeah. You hear me? All right. Toxic femininity. Ooh. That's a thing. It's real. And nobody's talking about it because people are afraid to touch shit like this. But we're not here. Talk to him. To run away from the talk topics. To him, that mean talk something. to him. Toxic femininity. Talk to him. Like, how many times do you hear about men calling the police on women because they're angry at them? I don't. Uh, putting their lives in jeopardy. Uh, 
getting them killed and locked up for no reason. Yeah. I don't really hear about it. I don't think they do it. I hear yeah, about women know. doing that all the time. Yeah. Yeah, all toxic. the time. That's toxic. Toxic, 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 toxic. Yeah, but let me not even... Let me, let me, we need more time to get into that. But yeah, we need a whole episode. We need a whole episode that. on that. But people are afraid to talk about it. We're not afraid to talk about shit. This is Anything? blunt shit. Yeah, it gets blunt here. This podcast gets blunt as shit. You feel me? Cut all this fake yeah. rah rah. <laughs> we got to we got we got tight for no reason. Um, uh, loving hip hop, uh, loving hip hop, loving hip hop, loving hip hop. G, loving hip hop. You don't talk about loving hip hop for real? Yeah, you saw it. Yeah, but so talk about it. I I've, I know the storylines enough. I thought to we were talking. I thought we were talking celebrities. I thought we were talking gossip. Yeah. Oh yeah. So you want some gossip? Yeah. All right. So. uh uh, let's do some gossipy shit, man. Gossip nah, talk. No, 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 no. I don't want to say that. But, uh... <laughs> Omarion wins again. <laughs> Yo, why, they hit it out. Omarion, me. April and Fizz, and Fizz broke up. Air oh. Fizzo. Fizzo. <laughs> Air Fizzy. Fizziando. Uh, his, fizzled out. Their relationship fizzled out. <laughs> Guess... <laughs> Guess what just fizzled out? Oh... <gasps> <laughs> April and Fizzo's relationship. Uh, I guess what Marion wins again. He does. Yes, he does, man. Another one for the good guys. Touch. <laughs> yeah. He won't be touching her anymore. Uh, you saw the uh, you saw the new uh, 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 Uzi Vert music video. The shuffle. Yeah, the shuffle music video. You fucking with it? I saw it. You was fucking with it. You was bright visuals. It was very. Uh, it was very entertaining. You was doing your thing? You, you, uh... I got my foot soul shuffle. I is was... your foot soul shuffle sturdy? It's not sturdy at all. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm not sturdy. It's not camera ready yet. Oh, okay. You know what I mean? Hell no. <laughs> yeah, right. I'm, I'm nowhere close. No foot soul shuffle, man. Stop trying to play me, baby. Nah. That's all on him. That's all on him right what there. What else is there? All of it. Any other uh, crazy shit? Anybody broke up? Anyone died? Shout out to all the dead niggas. LeBron is wildin'. Oh, they, oh yeah, I got some. I got some sports news. How do y'all feel about? How, how do y'all some sports oh, news? Oh, oh, yo, rest in uh, peace. Rest in peace to David Stern, T neck. Oh, I repeat, NBA uh, T neck, ex NBA commissioner, commission, NBA commissioner forever. Uh, rest in peace, David Stern. Shout out T neck, New okay. Jersey. Uh, yo, that's what's, what's up. What's up with your man? Yo, can we talk that's about the Lakers real quick? What's up? What's up with LeBron? Yo. Leading the league in assists. What's you up? You want to just talk about it right I, now? I'm the LeBron stan. So I hear the Lakers are shopping around uh, Kyle Kuzma, listening I, to the offers because I, uh, I, I don't. I was trainer shitted on Braun the other day with the with him liking the tweet. No, I think it's more like maybe uh, no, Kuzma. Did, did you hear about those? Did you hear about no, that? Not playing. I don't listen play. to the not rumors because I don't believe in the sources. Woj. It was from Woj. Oh, <clears throat> shit. We respect Woj, those. Woj reported on Yeah, it. we respect those. We respect Woj. <laughs> yeah, we right? respect those. <laughs> Get his face. <laughs> we respect those. I'm just saying, they're listening to offers. I, you shouldn't have did it. Hey, you should always be trying to make your team better. So yes. uh, that's always. normal. Yeah, I'm okay with that. That's so, the game. So you you're always with, trying you to, it's a business. Kuz? You're trying to make your team do better you fuck at all times. Do you fuck with Kuz? I mean, he's a promising uh, player with potential. Yeah. But who know, you know? I don't know him personally. I only know his basketball skills. You know. I mean, he don't dress good, but uh, he look like Eminem right now. Yeah, he dresses like Blossom. Mm-hmm. Oh, so, whoa, whoa, <laughs> Joey, mm-hmm. whoa, whoa. Mm-hmm. Um, they're never gonna get that references. We're, we're too old for that. No one knows what Blossom is. Mm. Six was bad. Oh man, mm. is she crazy now? Yeah. Nah, she's not crazy. She's still fire? Yeah. Oh, Topanga, shout out to you, man. It was fire back in the day. A lot of my niggas grew up loving you. I think we did great. Anything else you want to get off your chest? I think we did great. I think we did great. I mean, it's a whole episode basically on that uh, uh-huh. relationship shit. Yeah, yeah, so let's uh, wrap it up. Wrap it up? Wrap it up. Okay. Time to shut it yeah. down. Time to shut it the fuck down.
Uh, you good, Brian? You want me right? Everything We're going to do like how Ghost ended the last episode on last season. He waited for the lights to turn off and everything. You did? Damn, Once again, thank you for joining us on the Blunt Exchange. Uh, like we always say, we'll try to do better next, next week. Time. Yes. Uh, <laughs> always. And we'll keep try to keep it more blunt next week. Yes. You know what I mean? But uh, don't forget to follow us on all platforms. We're on Twitter, Instagram. Uh, Spotify. 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 Facebook, Twitter. YouTube. And Apple YouTube. soon on deck. Google yeah. Play soon on deck. Yeah. Blunt Exchange, that's without the E. That don't mean? forget to pull up, roll up, light up, and keep it blunt. Don't forget, follow us on all platforms. Twitter, Blunt Exchange. Instagram, Blunt Exchange. Facebook, Blunt Exchange. And you're already here. YouTube, Blunt Exchange. Don't forget to subscribe, like the videos, hit the notification bell, and send us a comment. 